Your visit now, uh, including your uh, visit to Jennifer Cobra, the exercise which we managed together. It's uh, another demonstration of the depths of our relationship, the cooperation between uh, our, for our, our armed forces, intelligence agencies, of course, and the defense establishment. Of course, we appreciate very much the relationship, as uh, we just see the United States as our greatest ally. And looking around to the Middle East together, as we are used to do, uh, to the chaotic situation, the instability in the region, many challenges ahead of us, which we together have to, to meet. And uh, I'm very glad for another opportunity to discuss the developing situation, the challenges ahead of us, for the benefit of our two countries. So thank you for coming back. No, thanks, thanks, Master. It's good to see you again, sir. And uh, and I, you recall my first visit uh, overseas was here, uh, and I very much appreciate the warm welcome I had. And uh, and during that visit, I told you that, that I was committed to the relationship, particularly the military to military relationship, and recognized that the relationship between our two countries is about much more than military to military relationship. But I actually believe that's one of the foundational elements. And I know General Breedlove works that every day. And and I made a commitment that I would that I would reinforce uh, his efforts, his day-to-day -day efforts. And uh, so you're right, this is my second time in a short period of time, but I think it reflects exactly what you just said. It, it reflects uh, how important this relationship is. And, and we do have a lot of issues uh, uh, to talk about during these challenging times, but the thing that gives me confidence that we'll actually be able to deal with these challenges is that we actually have partners and allies to deal with them. So uh, we'll get after that. But thank you. Thanks for making time to see me.